Papa. Why don't we ever talk about Mother? George, that is no way to talk to Father. Show a little more respect. I just want to know, Papa. When she died, did she know about the affair? George! Nope. Now, Ava, it's quite all right. Let the boy speak his mind. Do you truly wish to know the truth? Yes, Papa. All right. It all started on a steamboat. Hey, folks. Welcome to Applebee's. My name is Mel. I'll be your server today. Can I get you any drinks or appetizers straight away? Uh, appetizers are half price for happy hour. You know what? Some matzo sticks sound lovely on this fine evening. Do those come with the little dipping sauces? Why, yes, they do. We have ranch, blue cheese, marinara, and queso. Uh, hey, hey, stop, stop. I'm sorry. Um, I still don't understand why this has to be said at an Applebee's. Mm. Okay. We've been over this. Applebee's is a symbol for modern America. Right. But how? It is a melting pot of flavors and cuisines, just like this great nation of ours. That's one of your lines from the second act. That... Look! You auditioned for this show? If you don't want to do it, there's the door. Good. So, uh, let's start from dipping sauces and with feeling this time. Yes, we have ranch, blue cheese, marinara, and queso. Well, what an incredible selection. We'll take the ranch and the blue cheese and a round of crazy cherry margaritas. <laughs> okay, we'll have that right out for ya. <laughs> Papa, why do we always have to order the matzo sticks? Why can't we order the spinach artichoke dip instead? It reminds me oh so much of the green, green pastures back home. No, son, this family is a matzo stick family now, and I will not. Okay, I'm sorry, we go on about matzo sticks for three pages. Their phallic symbol, keep going. Uh, uh, perhaps at some time, we used to be a spinach artichoke dip nation, brother, but. Since the war, everything changed. Applebee's wasn't even around in the 40s. It's time blind setting. Didn't they discuss that on the set of General Hospital? You haven't even read the script, have you? Uh, obviously not, but did you even write the script? This reads like a two hour advertisement for Applebee's. Oh, I wrote the script. I wrote American Dinner with realistic reactions to actual Applebee's menu items in mind. I can't help it if Applebee's happens to delight and excite my characters. Why did you even audition if you hadn't read the script? I auditioned because of your reputation as a playwright and director. Clearly, I was wrong. I'm leaving. Good night. Anyone else? Oh, 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 what if we said it at Perkins instead? No, that would be ridiculous. Lap, please, lap, lap, please, lap. No. 